Next module we're going to try out is called memory one. So there's probably a memory two. It all depends how you want to look at it. So I was working on it and I found that I wanted another kind of look and that's what happens. You make alterations, you make new ways how to use this particular module. And this is explained in the wiki. So we can use all kinds of tokens. These things can be used in here. We use only percentage used. But let's maybe first go to memory one so you see already what's happening. So 120 load average is out. Memory one is the one we need and save. So this is memory one and this is memory two. So now you see what the difference is already. That's quite uh, completely on the look uh, and on the design. So well, let's go all the way down again to memory load average. Here it is. So a lot of things, copy paste a lot of things already from the GitHub. So all these available tokens can be used. You can check it out on this link. Change some colors, uh, foreground, use foreground. So these two things means that's used. That's 23% use of memory and um, fill this one used empty foreground. It's going to be white if it's empty. So all these things are just to say, okay, these things are all empty. There's a memory that's empty and these are things that are full, meaning it's used. Um, what else? We have a little cloud coming from the font. Awesome. Maybe you can get rid of these. I don't know. Let's have a look. Ah, it sticks a little bit to it. So that's probably why I did it. So, okay, a little bit space between it. And then the prefix the coloring again. So this blue, if you don't like the blue, you can change all these colors to something else. And this is the general color. So the format foreground is coming again from all the way up. One of the first lines. So you can change uh, the coloring and maybe also these elements, uh, label, percentage used, you can use something else if you want to. All right, enjoy.